Greetings, everyone. Oh, what a day it's been. Welcome back to Immaculate Wealth. Still working on the title of this. I might just go back to Mad Villainy. Alright, here we go. Going to talk about time. How to, man- how to manage it well. The surprising link between time management and financial success. Why the wealthiest people obsess over their schedules. How poor time management is costing you more than just productivity. The compound effect. How small time savings lead to big wealth gains. Why time might be more valuable than money in building wealth. The hidden time traps that are sabotaging your financial goals. How mastering your minutes can lead to mastering your finances. The time management secret that top CEOs swear by. Why traditional Management advice falls short in wealth building. How reclaiming your time can lead to unexpected income opportunities. The psychological benefits of time mastery on financial decision making. Why time abundance is the new status symbol among the wealthy. All right. What's the problem? The overwhelming nature of balancing work, personal life, and financial goals. How constant distractions erode both productivity and wealth building efforts. The difficulty of breaking ingrained time-wasting habits. Why most people underestimate the value of their time. Don't let them waste it. Know your value. Know the value of your time. The challenge of prioritizing long-term financial goals in a busy schedule. How procrastination impacts both daily productivity and long-term wealth. The stress, stress of feeling time poor and its effect on financial decisions. Why traditional time management Techniques often fail to stick. Y'all don't hear me, though. The struggle of finding time for side hustles. I don't recommend side hustles, but if you got a side hustle or additional income streams. How poor time management leads to costly mistakes and missed opportunities. The difficulty of maintaining work-life balance while pursuing financial goals. Why many people feel stuck in a time-money trade-off. Don't trade time for money. Again, know your worth. How do we fix this? What's the solution? Implement the Eisenhower matrix to prioritize tasks effectively. We may go over that later. Not in this video. Or you could use the Pomodoro technique 
to boost focus and productivity. Create a money hour each day dedicated to financial tasks and learning. Automate recurring tasks and financial transactions to save time and reduce errors. Utilize time tra tracking app apps to identify and eliminate time-wasting activities. Develop a morning routine that sets a productive tone for the day. This is what I like to do. I like to get, wake up early and get so much done while others are still slobbering in bed, snoring. I'm up. What have I done? I took a run. Even before that, and washed my face, brushed my teeth, I ran, went out, washed the car, cooked breakfast, came back, cooked breakfast, probably went to the grocery store, cooked breakfast, and did some other things, right? And it's not even 8 o'clock in the morning yet. Just getting it done. How about that? You dig? All right. So learn. Learn to say no to time commitments that don't align with your goals. Batch similar tasks to reduce context switching and increase efficiency. Schedule regular deep work sessions for high value activities. Use the two minute rule to prevent small tasks from piling up. Implement a weekly review to align your time usage with your financial goals. Create systems and routines that make productive behaviors automatic. All right, we're going to take some action, huh? Start tracking your time for one week to identify your biggest time wasters. Implement one new time management technique from the video this week. Share the biggest time management challenge in the comments. Create a prioritized to-do list for tomorrow before ending your day. Set up one automated financial task, like automating savings transfer, automating your investments, automating your cryptocurrency, automating, no, I'm just kidding. Identify one recurrent task in your life that you can delegate or eliminate. I like eliminating things. If I can delegate them, I'll delegate them, but I like to get rid of them all together if I can. Schedule a money hour in your calendar for next week. Share this video with a friend who struggles with time management. I know a few people that can use this. Leave a comment describing how you plan to link your time management to your financial goals. Try the Pomodoro technique for one day and share your experience. Reflect on your most productive times of day and plan your schedule accordingly. Don't forget to check out our five-day money mindset course. Link in the description to further align your time management with your financial success.
And that's that's the video for today. Like, share, subscribe. We're going to take some action. We're going to build. We're going to be out here with the wealth and flying to and fro. Whenever you want. All right. Well, this has been Silent Thriller for the Immaculate Wealth Podcast. And we out of here.